Hello friend, how are you today? I'm Brian Ferrier, lead pastor here at CIC, and today let's take a break and reflect on Mark chapter 12, verse 17. This is what it says. And Jesus said to them, Render to Caesar the things that are Caesar's, and to God the things that are God's. And they were amazed at him. This verse struck me out today because I'm in the process of preparing for my taxes. You know, gathering documents and reviewing receipts, it's not really my favorite thing to do every year, but you got to do it. And so in today's verse, the Pharisees use the subject of taxes as a means to trap Jesus in a statement. They asked him a controversial question. Is it lawful to pay a poll tax to Caesar or not? Perceiving their ill intent, Jesus held up a Roman coin, which bore the image of Caesar, and he gave them way more than an answer. Rendered to Caesar the things that are Caesar's. Their deceitful question was answered, but Jesus went one phrase further by saying, and to God the things that are God's. See, these men knew the Old Testament very well, and given the context, they would have understood the implication of Jesus' words. It was an unstated question. Whose image and likeness is stamped on you? It's a gospel answer to their sinful question. See, we bear the image of God. It tells us that in Genesis chapter 1, verses 26 through 27. And we are to give to God that which is His. And what's that? Our lives. If we bear his image, we are his children. We are made in his likeness. We got to give to God what belongs to him. That means our lives. So I'm amazed at Jesus' brilliance and how he just gave that quick answer, but he made them really connect and think on the things that matter most. See, knowing that we bear the image of Christ, the image of God, we're made alive through his Holy Spirit who lives in us, it makes us wonder, what is it that I'm giving to God? Have I given him what matters? It belongs to him anyways. Should I just bring it back? So I encourage you today to think and reflect on this and take inventory of what's going on, knowing that you bear his image. You are precious to him. You are loved. You are chosen. And God wants a meaningful relationship with you. So will you give it to him? Blessings.